So I have both Resident Evil 5 and Resident Evil 6 Gold Edition that are both on the PlayStation 3. Now these are just some really good games to have, you know, in your collection. They've been sort of, you know, lying around, you know, I've had them on my bookcase. And this is the reason why I'm doing a review on them today. Now, if you are a collector, you know, like I am, and you know, you're a PlayStation 3 fan, I'll suggest, you know, start off with the shoot 'em ups first, like Modern Warfare 2, and then you can move on to, you know, Resident Evil. This is the uh, whole reason why I got these games uh, first. The Gold Edition, you're probably wondering, you know, why you got this um, for twice, because saw that the Gold Edition, you know, was compatible with the PlayStation Move. Now, I've got the PlayStation I, but I've not got the uh, PlayStation Move uh, yet. Now, I would sooner just use, like, the DualShock controller. It's a lot more easier. The controls, you know, are not difficult at all. You can sort of, you know, pick up the controller and uh, away you go. Now, Resident Evil 5 is pretty cool because take a look at the back what does it say well we can add on some packs and some extra costumes within the PlayStation Store and you will find those on there they include some of the modes actually in this game they've actually included them on here within Resident Evil 5 we got uh, Lost in Nightmares Desperate Escape versus we got the Mercenaries uh, Reunion, some extra figures, Costume Pack 1's on there, and Costume Pack 2. And there we go. Then we come to Resident Evil 6. And if you compare both of these games next to each other, one of them actually has more modes on it, which is Resident Evil 6. And I think what I need to do is I need to sit down, you know, and actually play this one properly and just basically see what, you know, the story mode's about. How far I can get uh, through some of the levels. So now uh, Resident Evil 6 has co op. Now, co op is basically, you know, you can have up to four players. You can sort of like, you know, jump into somebody's game and you know you can team up with each other. So this was the first time, you know, uh, actually installing this game, you know, on my PS3. And oh my god, the graphics were just amazing. I played um the first part of uh, the campaign on Resident Evil 6 and oh my god I was just stuck on the first level and I figured it you know um, how to dash you press uh, the left uh, analog stick and the X button this did take you know actually you know a while to sort of like uh, figure out but uh, I managed to get through uh, the first level and now I've unlocked co-op which is good so this is my review on Resident Evil 6 and Resident Evil 5 my next video will be on my blu-rays this is Chris thanks for watching and you'll see me in uh, the next video